Hello, I'm Dr. Jennifer Ney. I'm the lead paleontologist and manager of the Natural Science Collections here at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. Today, we are going to be talking about how we get our fragile fossils from our dig site in Wyoming all the way to our lab here in Indianapolis to prep for you guys to see. Now, our fossils come in many different shapes and sizes, so each of these is going to be unique. Sometimes you can get things down to a vial or a little bag, but a lot of times you're going to be needing what we call a field jacket. So these are field jackets. This is like a paper mache for fossils and rocks. Each of these is going to be unique depending on the fossil or the package of fossils that we are trying to package up. So we're using a variety of materials. Take this field jacket, this is our dorsal jacket. It weighs a ton. So in order to support it, we had to use things like two by fours. The rest of the field jacket is pretty standard. You'll see some shiny bits, that's aluminum foil. We use that as a layer between the fossil and the next layer, which is a lot of plaster and burlap. So what we do is we take strips of burlap, dip it in the plaster, and then it's that paper mache, just wrapping it over and over and over again, sometimes for many, many layers, again, to make sure that this ton jacket gets back with all those fragile fossils nice and safe. The only problem is then some of these get to be very, very thick. So you'll notice that we'll have to use things like saws to open them up. So think of it as a present you're really excited for, but you have to take your time because you have to use a saw to open it up. For our smaller fossil jackets, we can actually use pre-plastered bandages like this. Um, and these are the same kind of bandages that they'll actually use on people when you break an arm. Now, once our fossils are all packaged up, then we need to move them. For the smaller fossils, like this one, we can move them by hand. But for some of our larger fossils, we need specialty equipment. In the field, that's things like bobcats moving our fossils. Here in the museum, we use things like pallet jacks and forklifts. It's a lot of work to get those from the dig to the lab, but once it's all done, you get the reward of beautifully preserved fossils all ready to be cleaned up here at the museum for you guys to see. And that is how we get our fragile fossils from our dig site in Wyoming to our lab here in Indianapolis. Thanks for joining us behind the scenes here at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis.